Yeah. So the uh, the leaders in here. What were those on the signs? That is a. That that looks kind of like the Complexly logo. Is that a Groudon? What is that over there? Move. Can't see. Anyway, we're gonna fight. Gym leader B. Okay, so so B is not the old lady. B is a uh, B is the the fighting type, the 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 gym the, the gym workout person trainer lady. Um, I guess Opal is the uh, someone else. I know I saw an old lady in the uh, in the opening ceremonies, but let's see. Can I can I hone claws? Can I get away with honing claws first, and then having increased attack for the rest of the battle? Opal is probably a rock gym, right? Yeah, you're going to you're going to counter me. That's not going to work. I kind of wanna I kind of wanna hone claws again, just in case you decide to counter me again. All right. My attack is doubled now. Come on, use counter again. Revenge. Okay, that didn't do too much damage when Hitmonlee did it. I hope it won't here. That did... Okay. You're a little stronger than Hitmonlee in terms of both level and your, your base attack. No, no, Hitmonlee's the, Hitmonlee's the offensive one. Hitmonchan is the, uh, the defensive one. Revenge. I might be in trouble. Okay, so much for that strategy. I'm sorry, old brick. One hold clause and then attack me might have been enough, um, but it's too late for that. I will make an attempt. Let's see what allergies can do. I will make an attempt to do as little item spamage in this battle as I can. I can't tell what that red thing on the sign is. It almost looks like like Amy Rose or something, except uh, it can't possibly be. I have no idea what that might be. All right, anyway, hit him on top is done. Good job, allergies. Um, yeah, Wrigley. Uh, unfortunately, Ulbrich will not be gaining experience here unless I revive her. Pangaro. That's the unevolved form, isn't it? No, Panchan, Pangaro, and... Oh, Pangaro's the big one. Okay. Hee <laughs> hee, I knew that. Can I inflict status on you? Make you, uh, make you, make you uh, sneeze or something? Let's just see how much damage work up. Okay, that's gonna... I, I want to get this battle over with as, as quickly as possible. You, both your offenses are going up. Pangaro's a... Oh, come on. Pangaro's a decidedly physical attacker, but... If you have a special attack, that it won't do me any favors when you, when you work up. Alright, let's see if I can slow you down. I, I will not be punched that well. Night Slash. Okay, that is not a fighting move. Ow. Fortunately, if I recall from when I used Pangaro myself, Pangaro was quite slow. So I will be able to go first here. She paralyzed. I'll be able to stall a bit. Night Slash. Nope. Okay. Let's power flinch then. Let's do the old power flinching thing. Goodbye, Shackleton. I sound way too happy about that. Um, oh, there you are. Headbutt. Yes, headbutt. Headbutt's what I'm looking for. Fighting dark type. If I can, uh, you're level 36, you're level 34. If I can flinch you a couple times and then, and then double kick you, that should do some damage. Nope. Okay. That suck. That sting. No. Hey, pain. Me no like pain. Bullet punch. All right. That work up. Although it still would have been a two KO even without the work up, but I may have to go and revive some people. Come on, nip nip. Can I flinch you with? Can I flinch you with uh with bite? Oh, you know what? I have an idea. I don't think you're going to be able to. Perfect timing. I don't think you're going to be able to one hit KO me because I, I have quite um, existent defenses. Was that a reduced priority move? Since when does counter ever go first? Come on. No, really. I want you to hit me. 
I want you to hit me. What is this? This is the opposite of my luck when I was fighting Lance and Heart Gold. Alright, come on. No, don't do that again. Your attack is doubled. I get it. Just, just, just do half my health. Do two-thirds of my health. God's sake. Circle throw. That's what you were doing. <laughs> is everything going to blow up my face here today? Can I flinch you with Steve? I'm going to take less damage from fighting. Can I flinch you with Steve? Okay, there we go. That's a critical hit. Finally, a critical hit when I need it. There have not been that many of those in this game. And uh, Steve and Allergies get all the experience from that one. Mostly Allergies. Synthesis, I think not. Surfetched. Okay, so that answers my question about the uh, the evolution. <clears throat> Surfetched. You're gonna max. Max knuckle. I'm feeling just by looking at you, steel fighting. I'm getting a distinct steel impression here. Like I said earlier, I know this thing exists, but I don't know what it looks like. Or at least, I didn't know what it looked like until about 30 seconds ago. Okay. Surfetched. You're gonna max here, right? You had three Pokemon. I think I saw you have three Pokeballs. You didn't max. Okay. Um, that appears to be... Oh no, I don't like where this is going. I I don't like where this is going. Oh, you have one more after this. Which may prove to be an issue. Let's max strike on your face and see if... I, I, I'm going to revert after this turn. Oh, does that break through protect and detect? Like some of the Z-moves do? I think all of the Z-moves do, or at least they, uh... You... Yeah, it couldn't fully protect it. I think it still does a third damage. Anyway, it didn't say it wasn't very effective. So there goes Surfetched. And, uh... Everyone gained experience. Steve gained a level. I'm, I'm going to revert after this, unfortunately. Machamp. Machamp. I am reverting, right? I, yes, I am. Okay. There is uh, an approximately roughly 0% chance that this is going to work in my favor, especially after, after you go Dynamax. So I'm going to take this opportunity. Sorry, Steve. I'm going to take this opportunity to go revive Shackleton. And I'm going to hope that I'm able to get off a, a Paralysis. All right, Gigant, Gigant, Giganta, Giganta, whatever, Maxing. See, I feel like I could have made this battle quite a lot easier for myself if I'd, uh, if I'd been a little bit more careful with Ulbrich at the beginning. But I didn't. And Machamp... And Mr. Ball is, is on that screen back there. Um, G-Max Kai Strike. Steve lived. Your attack, something went up. I don't know if that was critical hit ratio or, or attack. I think getting pumped usually refers to critical hit ratio. Um, a la focus energy. I can't believe Steve lived that. All right. In that case, this is my only, my only max revival item left. Old brick. You're going to revert after three uh, after three turns as well. 
Why? All, all of the max Pokemon have those clouds hovering around them. On the champ, it's by the waist. On that centipede thing, it was by the tail. Um, why is that so ominous? That's two turns, by the way. And I don't know how your speed stats affected when you Gigantamax. And I'm going to hope that my champ is slow enough that I will be able to, uh, to outspeed either way with, uh, with Shackleton. I, I am not. Okay. Anyway, I resist that. I don't have as, as good defense as Wulu does. And I don't have the ability, but I do resist that. My speed fell. I don't really care. Nuzzle. You're not protected from status when you're max, right? Good. So you're unable to move. You're going to revert. And I think the tide has turned uh, decidedly in my favor. <clears throat> Flail. Flail should do decent decent damage here. It's uh, I'm, I'm at pretty low health. Okay, that that actually wasn't decent, but I'll take it. Strength. And Shackleton goes down for a second time. Sorry, buddy. Um, Ulbrick. Unless Machamp has Stone Edge, and I don't think Machamp learns Stone Edge until later. And in any case, that's a rather strong move to have at this point in the game. Let's, uh... Let's unnerve you. And then Home Claws you. What's my secondary type even on Ulbrick? Do I have one? Knock off. There goes the sharp beak. Oh, no, 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 no. Yes, that's right. Knock off does, oh. Knock off does extra damage if you're, uh, if you have an item. I'm pure flying. All right, pure flying types are pretty, uh, pretty rare. You're in, you're in elite company with Tornadus. And I want to say one other thing from Gen 7, but I'm not sure. All right. Can I leave Tornado you? Am I holding an item? I don't think I'm holding an item. Okay, that's not doing anything. You're gonna scary face me. Lower my speed, although that's not really too devastating because your speed's already quartered by paralysis. Can I just leave Tornado you to death? That's like a five hit KO. I'm not going to. I'm going to, uh, I'm going to make better choices when it comes to Old Brick. Yeah, okay. You have knockoff, you have strength, you have scary face, and you have revenge. It's gonna lower your speed, okay. Uh, I, I don't feel confident that I can survive another hit. Um, I may, I may stall with revives. For a bit. Steve took the hit pretty well last time. Okay, strength. No same type attack bonus, and Ulbrick went down. Be paralyzed. I know you are paralyzed like four times in a row with a, uh, with a Pangaro. I know you are paralyzed like four times in a row with the Pangaro, but I'd really like it if you could be if you could be paralyzed now. It's a good thing I have so many revives, right? Alright, you're gonna scary face me. You're paralyzed and your speed is down by one stage, so you're... You, you're about... You're less than 20% as fast as you ordinarily would be. Um... Nope, not, not that. I'm going to start... Uh, I'm gonna start power flinching you. Hopefully this will be- oh wow, critical hit, thank you. Another timely one. And you're gonna keep using Scary Face. I don't know why you're not using Re Revenge. Revenge you would think would be would be doing a lot of damage to me. Alright, I wanted- I wanted the uh, at least one more Pokemon around for, for insurance, but if I'm able to take you down with uh, with just Headbutt, I, I won't complain. Alright, that was a- uh, not the- not the- most glamorous battle I've ever taken part in, but it'll it got the job done. Um, there will be good ones and there will be bad ones depending on how how well I'm equipped to take on a gym. And uh, some of them on some of them I can take on pretty well, like Kabu's gym, and some of them I I am going to fare not quite as well against like a uh, what's your name Nessa and B here. All right.
awkwardly long handshakes version 4. I've got a cousin who likes to do that. Alright, so I'll meet many more trainers and have many more matches in the future. All of those encounters will nourish my spirit. Yeah, probably. Alright, congrats on defeating B. This is TM for Revenge, which is a good one. Um, it's not... It's not Shadow Ball or anything for the, for the training record, but it's, uh, it's a good move. Can I teach that to the, fight, the fire type, the bunny? Alright. I don't believe I've actually taught any TMs to anybody in this game so far. Oops. Um, Volt Switch. I have Volt Switch? When did I pick up Volt Switch? I'll teach that to Shackleton. Um, we can get rid of... We can get rid of Flail. I have three Electric-type moves. Um, those are probably not going to stay. I'm not really counting Nuzzle as an Electric-type move because that's really my Paralysis inducer. Um, that also happens to deal damage. Retaliate. That's a bit situational, but also, it's the same base power as, as Headbutt. So it has the potential to do twice as much as damage. Revenge. I actually can't teach that to the bunny. Ulbrich can, though. And Nip Nip. Leer. Leer sucks. We're getting rid of Leer. Maybe, I, maybe I'll teach it to Nip Nip also. Okay, let's teach Revenge to to Nip Nip over Protect. This is a very situa a, a very similar thing to um to my my philosophy when I was playing Heart Gold with Machamp. Um, quite slow. Maybe not as slow as Machamp, but still rather slow. We'll probably be moving second a lot, and uh. Good physical attack. 64 speed. It's actually not that not that bad. Slightly lower than uh than Fluffy's. I mean Steve's. Huh. Okay, so on second thought, that's actually the third fastest member of my team. Okay, I'm going to end this off here. I've been going for a while. My name is Dragonite. This has been Pokemon Pokemon Sword. What's this? Oh, that's that's a Yamper. What are you doing, Sonya? Looks like my Yamper really likes you, huh? Anyway, we've run into each other at a good time. You know that mural here in Stoan side? It said that it said to tell the story of a hero of Galar as well. Though what's here today is actually a replica of the ancient art that used to be there. You tend to have surprisingly sharp insights, so I was wondering if what you might think when you see the ruins. I think a very big five-year-old went and scribbled on the wall. Something blew up. Is that to do with the crack in the wall? All right. Well, here an explosion. Just run in that direction. That's the that's safety 101. All right. Why do I feel like I'm in for a long cutscene? I'm going to end this off here. So, my name is Dragonite. This has been Pokemon Sword. In the next part, we will see what blew up. Not not in this part. I will see you all later.